Uh, okay, let's quickly go through the procedure of downloading the isograph application through PC3 serial interface to the controller. First step, uh, just like normal, we start the hyperterminal program. Give it a name. Uh, select the the serial port we are using. In my case, it's uh, COM15. Then click OK. Set the parameters such as the board rate to 9600 and uh, set the flow control to none. Click OK. Then we um, cycle the power of PC3 controller and uh, keep pressing the uh, the tilde key of the keyboard. Then you will see the um, five option menu. Um, please notice that we need to uh, upgrade the kernel to version 1.48 to use the this feature. Now we press the key F to download the file to controller. Uh, enter the root password which is um, net silicon as usual. Okay. Now the kernel is starting. After that um, it will be waiting for your um, downloading the the application. So before you um, select any application file, let's just go to the application folder, uh, go to the configure one target binaries uh, subdirectory and select all the um, binary files, then um, put them into a zip file. You can give the zip file any name you want, that doesn't matter. In this case, I'll call it PROG1. Then press OK. Please remember, uh, do not enter any password here, otherwise the file cannot be identified by the PC3 controller. So just click OK to create the PROG1.zip file. Then we go back to the hyperterminal. Um, select the transfer, send the file, click a browse to um, to select the zip file we just created. Click open, then um, select the protocol of um, 1K X modem. Click send the button. Wait a couple of seconds, then um, the zip file has been transferred to the controller, and then the local, I mean the um, currently connected controller will be uh, searching the remote controllers on his on the um, the Ethernet interface, and the only the the other PC3 controllers um, belong to the same subnet can be discovered. So it will list, give a list of um, the neighbor Ethernet neighbor controllers and uh, ask you if you want to download the uh, yes or no. If you select the yes, then it will ask you uh, if you want to save file to this local controller as well. So you um, press yes. Just press Y to yeah, to say yes. Okay. 
if you select a node, that means the local controller will be uh, operating just like a, a gateway. So if you press yes, the zip file will be transferred to all the uh, neighbor Ethernet neighbor controllers as well as the local one. And uh, well, you can see that uh, the binaries has been transferred. Then you can press R to reset the controller. It's very easy to load the application through serial interface.